and the light quoting Jesus he said he that believeth in me though he were dead yet shall he live and whosoever liveth and believeth in me shall never die Job said I know that my redeemer liveth that he shall stand at the latter day upon the earth though after my skin worms destroy this body yet in my flesh I shall see God whom I shall see for myself and mine eyes shall behold and not another Paul said in 1 Timothy, We brought nothing into this world, and certain we can carry nothing out. Job added, The Lord gave, and the Lord has taken away. Blessed be the name of the Lord. For as much as it has pleased uh, Almighty God in His wise <coughs> providence to take out of the world the soul of Jerry, we therefore commit his body to the ground, earth to earth, ashes to ashes, dust to dust, looking for the resurrection and the life of the world to come through our Lord Jesus Christ, at whose coming the corruptible bodies of those who sleep in him will be changed and shall be made like unto his glorious body, according to the mighty working whereby he is able to subdue all things unto himself. Now the God of peace that brought again from the dead our Lord Jesus Christ, that great shepherd of the sheep through the blood of the everlasting covenant make you perfect in every good work to do his will, working in you that which is well-pleasing in his sight through Jesus Christ, to whom be glory forever and ever. Amen. Father in heaven, we're thankful that in times like these we do have a kind and loving heavenly Father that we can turn to for grace, for strength, and for help. Father, we're grateful for your faithfulness in days gone by, and we're grateful to know that we can trust in your faithfulness in the days and years to come. Father, I pray that in these days and these weeks that follow this time, that in the moments of sorrow you would be a God of all comfort, and then in the moments of loneliness you would be a very present help, and in the overwhelming moments that you would be the Prince of Peace to speak peace.
responsible freedom of this country. The white stripes boldly proclaim the peace that he helped to bring to our future generations. This is his flag. This is our spiritual heritage. Receive it with the tears of our minds and the faith of our hearts. Amen. Or you can just step up and we'll be sure to see that you get one. Thank you. 